Hello, today we're going to be discussing how to subtract integers. Let's jump right in. As you can see here, it says when subtracting integers, remember three letters. You're probably thinking, what are you talking about? I'm serious. All I want you to do is remember the letters K A O. Okay, what does it stand for? It stands for keep add opposite, okay? And in this line, it's gonna tell you, remember, you're never actually, what do you mean you're never actually? Follow me, follow along here. You're never actually subtracting, okay? When we're talking about subtracting negative numbers, all you're doing, you are just keep adding the opposite, okay? Keep, add, opposite. Now, what do you mean? Okay, we have three examples that perfectly show us what I'm talking about. So if I have eight minus negative two, I'm not gonna subtract. I'm gonna keep this first number, which is eight, okay? And then instead of subtracting, I am going to change my subtract to an add. And then I'm gonna take the opposite of negative two, which is positive two. So really you have eight plus two, and that is 10. Okay, let's do some more. Example two, I have nine minus 10. Remember, I'm not gonna subtract. I'm gonna just, I'm going to add the opposite. So I'm going to keep my nine the same I'm going to change my subtraction to an addition, and then I'm gonna take the opposite of 10, which is negative 10. And do you remember our adding rules? What do we do when they are different signs? We are going, if different signs, we're gonna subtract, so 10 minus nine is one. The absolute value of 10 is, or the absolute value of negative 10 is 10, and that's bigger than nine. So I'm gonna take the sign of this number and the sign is negative. So my answer is gonna be negative one. Okay, let's do example three. I'm this is a negative six, so I'm going to keep my negative six. I'm going to change my subtract to an add. And what is the opposite of two? Negative two. So is this same sign or different. They are the same sign. So we're going to add and keep the negative. I actually wanna do one more that's not on here that you might see um, that uh, might be a little bit tricky. So I'm gonna go ahead and actually add an example four. I'm gonna make this um, black. So I have negative four minus negative one. Let's see what happens here. Okay, so I'm gonna keep my negative four and I'm going to go ahead and add the opposite. So what is the opposite of subtract? Well, I'm gonna change it to an add and the opposite of negative one is positive one. So now again, I have different signs. So different signs tells me I'm gonna subtract. So four minus one is three, and the absolute value of negative four is gonna be bigger than the absolute value of one. So I'm gonna take the sign of this four, which is negative. So my answer is negative three. So don't forget, all I want you to do is remember K-A-O, keep add opposite.